the ego mechanism in the human being is that part of the waking state consciousness that tells you that you are something. You create yourself as a form, body, name, and then that's the reference point for you to see the world, always from the point of view of this body with these senses. And then I could say, I'm Robert Greene, it's the body, and identify as Robert Green. And then I go throughout the world as my waking state, based on my waking state is that identity. And that's the function of the waking state ego mechanism, create a, create a form, and you uh, have the ability to perceive the world from that. But it's totally artificial creation just for the purpose of functioning in the world. There's no such thing as Robert Green form, identity, body, consciousness filling up some form. There's only consciousness pure. That's all that exists is pure energy. Pure energy is all that exists. And so to be able to live the freedom from sense of birth and death and fear perpetrates the waking state of a normal human being. You have to get aware, become aware of yourself prior to that mechanism that says this is a form. In deep sleep, in dream state, there's no such form. It's only in this waking state that this is created. So to remember yourself as pure prior to that, then you never get created. You just live in freedom. Form is there, it's used, it's used, but the being is never confused by that form. It's always knowing that it's pure, free energy, pure being, pure bliss, pure consciousness, the absolute God that that alone is. That can be lived, You've seen it done. We're working on that. Amaram ham, madaram ham.